and the auto sequence is starting. The first uh, umbilical tower has been separated from the booster. T minus 45 seconds, the ground umbilical to the third straight stage has been disconnected. The launch command will be issued at T minus 19 seconds. It's about 10 seconds from now. T minus 15 seconds, the second umbilical tower is now separating. 10 seconds, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. And liftoff. Liftoff of Karen Nyberg, Fyodor Yushikin, and Luca Parmitano on a six hour ride to the International Space Station. Good first stage performance. The Soyuz delivering 102 tons of thrust from its four boosters and single engine. The first stage of the Soyuz measures 68 feet in length, 24 feet in diameter, burning liquid fuel for the first two minutes and six seconds of flight. After 30 seconds, all parameters for the Soyuz rocket are nominal. One minute into the launch, velocity should be 1,100 1, miles an hour. Soyuz blazing into the night sky over Kazakhstan. seconds into the flight and all systems are go. The escape tower has been jettisoned. The four uh, strap-on boosters have been jettisoned and these have completed their job and are going to be dropping away to an altitude of 28 statute miles. The Soyuz traveling at 3,350 miles an hour. Now receiving uh, live views from inside the Soyuz capsule. At the bottom is uh, Fyodor Yushikin. At the top, Luca Pamitano as they monitor the controls of the Soyuz as it climbs into orbit. Shroud jettison has been confirmed. The rocket's altitude now approximately 48 miles tall. Soyuz uh, traveling at approximately 4,700 miles an hour now. Mission Control Moscow reports all parameters are normal. Second stage engines are in normal operation. The Soyuz core stage performing as expected.